Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another haul video for you all. I feel like I've been doing so many hauls lately but whatever, it's close to my birthday so I can excuse it. But yeah, so I do have quite a decent amount of high-end stuff in this haul so I'm sorry if you don't like higher-end hauls but that's just the stuff that I've been buying so I'm just going to show you what I bought. So yeah, let's just get started. In one of my recent hauls I mentioned the YSL Touche Eclat Foundation absolutely love that so I picked up the YSL Youth Liberator there isn't much I need to say about this to be honest I just really wanted to try it and this is what the packaging looks like so definitely look out for first impressions on that and just for reference I picked up the shade B20 which is the lighter shade in Australia I also picked up a Benefit Their Real mascara um, I ran out of my little sample size and I just thought why not so I just picked up because the lady was super nice to me and she was so like helpful and nice and not annoying like all the other benefit ladies are. I don't know if any of you guys experience that but I feel like sometimes they're just so annoying. Like they just won't leave you alone. Do you guys like ever experience that? I don't know. Sorry about that but my hair was annoying me. So I just had to tie it up. Um, just because like, it gets all over the place and I'm not a fan of that so I just tied it up. Sorry if that annoyed anybody. Um, moving on to some skincare, I picked up the Hydroluron Moisture Booster, and this is by Indeed Laboratories. Um, my friend Fran, I'll link her blog down below, she talked me into getting this. Um, I see it on sale, so I was like, why not? Um, I've used it twice so far, and I can see that my skin is more moisturized when I put it on, because apparently like the little Hydroluron particles can hold up to 100 times its own weight in water. So... That's amazing. Okay, so the next thing that I purchased was five MAC lipsticks. Like seriously, the, like MAC is so smart. Like I walked through one, if you've been to the Maya in QVB, um, like Sydney Town Hall, did that make any sense to anybody? Whatever. Um, they have one MAC counter at the, like at one entrance on like the same floor and then another MAC counter at the other entrance. So if you were to like walk through, you pass it twice. And I always swatch something. And like, the walk is just long enough to be like, I really want it. And then you buy it, the other one, it's horrible, but whatever. So I picked up five. Um, I'll tell you what shades they are. So I bought Up The Amp, which is an amplified, which looks like this. Super excited to use this one. It's really, really pretty. I bought Hue, which I've been wanting for ages. And this is a glaze. I've never owned a glaze from MAC, I don't think. Cyber, which is a satin, which looks like that. Love Lawn, which looks like this. I'm so excited for this one. And Russian Red. So excited for this one also. Can't wait to use those. And also when I was at the Benefit counter, I picked up one of these Benefit Creaseless Cream Shadows. Um, this one is in the shade Skinny Jeans. And I just really wanted a dark grey base. Um, just to do like smoky eyes or something like that. But yeah, it just looks like this. I own one already and I am absolutely in love with that one. It's so good. So I just thought I may as well pick up another one and what better occasion than my birthday. Or for my birthday, I should say. Whatever. Okay, so from Priceline, I picked up two of the Revlon Colorburst Matte Balms. I bought the shade Shameless and Elusive. Um, I'll do swatches for you. Why not? Like, can you see those there on my hand? They are so good. This one's the Elusive. And there's a truck passing my house. That's the Elusive shade. And that's the Shameless shade. I've been loving these so far. They're so, so, so good. Quickly, I'll just mention two skincare products. I picked up the Origins 10 Minute Mask to quench skin's thirst. I basically picked this up um, because I really wanted a mask. Yeah, I just really wanted a mask. So I picked that up and then I also picked up an exfoliator like for my face. This is the Clarins One Step Gentle Exfoliating Cleanser with Orange Extracts. It's just the orange one and I really, really, really like it so far. It's really, 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 really good. <laughs> I don't think I could have said really enough in that sentence. Okay, so I think we're moving on to the last two products of the haul. Who did I see all this? I think it was Graveyard Girl. Oopsie. Um, but this is the powder here. It's like a beigey highlight color and it's in the shade Moonstone. Super, super, super excited to try that. Um, when I swatched it in store, it was just absolutely beautiful. So I had to get it. 
but it was really pricey. Okay, so the last product that I purchased was the Bobbi Brown Bronzing Powder in the shade Golden Light. And the lady serving me was so lovely. Um, it just looks like this. And yeah, I want to see how it compares to my Makeup Forever one. But yeah, super excited to see how this compares to my Makeup Forever one. Um, you do get less product in this. You only get 8 grams of product and it was very pricey. But whatever. That's expected from Bobbi Brown. Okay guys, so that's the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let me know if you want to see any of these products in future videos because I'd be more than happy to do that. But yeah, so I hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. Bye!